going to teach you a lesson that will help you grow your law firm by about 5%. Now, 5% may not mean anything to you until you do the math. Let's say you're grossing a million dollars, 5% is $50,000. Let's suppose you're grossing $100,000, 5% is $5,000. If you're still billing by the hour, and you're billing you know, $250 an hour, $5,000 is gonna take you 20 hours. Maybe that doesn't matter to you, maybe it does. Little hinges swing big doors. The way you build a multi-million dollar business is not by doing some grand gesture. The way you build a multi-million dollar business is by doing lots of little things good enough. You thought I was gonna say right. No, you don't have to do them right. You just have to do them good enough. So we're here in San Francisco at the Lean Startup Conference, which is an amazing thing you should investigate. Lean Startup, just do a search, is huge. Surrounded by about a thousand entrepreneurs, most of them under 30, almost all of them, most of them under 30, and you're hearing stories about how they had an idea for an idea, they had an idea for business, they took action, and next thing you know, they're doing a million dollars and they're selling it. It's inspiration. It's amazing. We're here at this little breakfast joint, and as you can see, the sun is blinding me. And this was the only seat in the whole place, and there was a line out the door. And the whole place is walking around. The, the staff is walking around, acting like, acting like this is like a new revelation to them that they've got this problem, that they've got this window that's literally, I <laughs> this, that's like blinding customers. And they're, they're walking around like surprised by it. Like, as if them being surprised is supposed to make us feel better that they didn't know about this problem earlier. Here's the point. We did a little calculation, and I'm gonna say, I'm gonna spare you the details, but me and Christopher Anderson, who's our director of programs, who's holding the, the phone right now, holding the camera right now, we did a little rough calculation, and we figured that this problem is probably costing this place about 5% of revenue. It's just you watch the way the tables are turning, you watch the way that people try to avoid certain seats, you figure the average price per seat, per, per breakfast, per, you come out to it's about 5%. We're figuring it's probably a reasonable number of what this problem is probably costing the owner of this business. There are things going on in your business right now that are costing you 5%. Here's my challenge to you. Mystery shop your own law firm this week. Pick up the phone and call the office or have a friend call the office and pretend like they're a prospective client who wants to schedule an appointment and have them record it or just listen in. And then have the friend who your staff doesn't know actually show up for the appointment and then have them go through the sales process with someone on your team and I promise you it'll be gut-wrenching, it'll be aggravating, it'll drive you crazy, but it'll also help you identify an opportunity to increase your revenues by at least 5%. Here's the next thing you can do. Pretend like you're a file. Literally, like just imagine, like remember that, that, that uh, cartoon when we were kids? I'm just a bill. Sitting on Capitol Hill, right? Another one. Pretend like you're a file and work your way. I'm literally perspiring. The sun is so hot coming through this window. <laughs> it's cold outside. Um, pretend like you're a file and work your way through the office and see how many times you literally have to crisscross the office. I remember a story that Christopher Anderson told when he was managing partner of a about a four million dollar, about a four million dollar law firm, and they 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 did this exercise and they found that files were like crisscrossing the office. I think they figured out like nine times for something that if they just moved a few people from this side of the office to that side of the office and these people to that side of the office, that same file could only cross the office three times. Every time that file's got to cross the office, it costs money, it costs time, it's risk of something getting lost, right? Uh, they also told me, that, he also told me that when they renovated that building, they found, how many feet? 2,000 square feet 
they suddenly found the building at 2,000 extra square feet just because they got rid of all of the curvy hallways and nooks and crannies that were useless. We all have, we all, me too, we all have this in our business. And so my challenge to you this week is to do one of these exercises and find that 5% and then find a way to reinvest that 5% in your business. If I handed you $5,000 in cash and said, reinvest this $5,000 to make your business better, you'd find a way to make your business better. If you already have a million dollar business and I handed you $50,000 and said, here's $50,000 to reinvest to make your business better, you'd find a way to spend the $50,000. The money is there. Go get it.